Hello students, today we will be discussing about the 2020 online and self-guided PFA modules supplemental to the SEES manual. Psychological First Aid or PFA Psychological First Aid The two main goals of PFA for students and teachers are to stabilize the emotions and behaviors of students and to return students to an improved mental and emotional state after a crisis or disaster ready to attend school and re-engage in classroom learning. Module 1 Validating Feelings and Normalizing Reactions Objectives Identify feelings, reactions related to the pandemic, any form of disaster. Accept that all feelings and reactions are normal and valid. Materials for today, notebook, pen, and crayons. Kumusta kayo? How is it going? Are you well? Are you alright? Activity 1. Identify 5 feelings or emotions that you have experienced during the past few months, weeks, or days. Ano yung mga limang pakiramdam na inyong naranasang ngayong nakasailalim tayo sa quarantine dulot ng pandemya? This is the format. My feelings are the following. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Write your answers on your notebook. Isulat ang limang pakiramdam na iyong naranasan o naramdaman sa inyong notebook. Using your materials, make a graph that shows your emotions that you experienced in the past months due to pandemic quarantine. Gagawa tayo ng graph upang malaman natin ang mga feelings na inyong naranasan. This is the example of my emotions bar graph. In the x-axis, you can see the four emotions, worried, scared, angry, and numb. In the y-axis, you are going to write the numbers 0, 25, 50, 75, and 100. Analysis. What are the feelings that were mentioned a lot? Ano yung mga pakiramdam na iyong naisulat sa iyong notebook? What did you notice about your reactions to the different situations? Paano mo hinaharap o ano yung mga ginagawa mo sa mga sitwasyon na iyong kinakaharap? Number three. Are these normal reactions to everything that you experience? Normal lang ba talaga ang iyong nararamdaman? Share your answers to your classmates. Today, we learned that our reactions to the pandemic, to any stressful event, disaster, are normal and valid. Naway natutunan nyo na ang reaksyon sa pandemya ng ating kinakaharap ay talaga nga namang nakakastress. Ngunit, lahat ng inyong nararamdaman ay normal lamang. Common Reactions of Students to Stressful Events Feel a strong responsibility to the family. Feel anxious brought about by uncertainty of the future. Feel intense or prolonged grief for not being able to wake. May become self-absorbed and feel self-pity. May experience changes in their relationships with the other people. May also start taking risks, engage in self-destructive behavior, have avoidant behavior, and become aggressive. May experience major shifts in their view of the world accompanied by a sense of hopelessness about the present and the future. May become defiant of authorities and parents while they start relying on peers for socializing through social media and may feel guilty and anxious having been separated from their loved ones due to lockdown. 
How can you apply this learning to your life, especially because the pandemic is not yet over? Paano mo maisasabuhay ang mga natutunan mo ngayon kung paano mo haharapin ang iba't ibang feelings or emotions na iyong nararamdaman? Remember, it's good that you realize that these are normal reactions as of this time. I want you to realize that it is okay to not feel okay. Tell to yourself, all these are normal feelings na nararanasan din ng ibang tao. Normal lang ang pakiramdam ko. Module 1 Handout When Terrible Things Happen Intermediate Reactions There are a wide variety of positive and negative reactions that students can experience during and immediately after crisis situations. These include the four domains, four negative responses, and four positive responses. The first one is the cognitive. It includes confusion, worry, and self-blame. For the positive responses, determination, courage, optimism, and faith. For the second domain, we have the emotional. Negative responses are shock, sorry, grief, sadness, fear, anger, numb, irritability, guilt, and shame. For the positive responses, feeling involved, challenge, mobilize. And for the third domain, we have the social. Negative responses are fight with others or does not speak with others. Positive responses, six out others who can help them helps others in need. And for the fourth one, psychological, tired, headache, muscle tension, stomach ache, difficulty sleeping, fast heartbeat. And for the positive responses, alertness, readiness to respond, and increased energy. Activity number two. You are going to write a letter to your friend about. During the months of lockdown, what were the five routines or reaction you did at home? Ano nga ba yung mga limang bagay na pinagkakaabalahan mo or pwedeng sumobra pa sa lima na mga ginagawa mo sa bahay ngayong meron tayong pandemya at lahat tayo ay nasa ilalim ng quarantine? Here is an example. Dear friend, during the pandemic, most of the time, I just slept on the bed and browsed the internet. Sometimes, I watch the television to entertain myself. Every morning, I help my mother doing the household chores. But there were times that I felt sad because I missed the outside world. There were times that I felt bored and afraid. But I am so blessed because my family is always here to support me as well as my friends. Especially you who are always willing to talk to me. I love you and I miss you. Sincerely yours, Jonathan. See you again tomorrow for the continuation of the PFA modules. Keep safe! Tandaan, sa panahon ngayon mga bata, ang kalusugan ang importante sa lahat.